Hey there, and welcome to Fallout Plays. I'm Fallout, of course, and today I have another Trials of Osiris guide for you, this time for Burning Shrine, which happens to be one of my favorite maps. Alright, let's get into it. For Burning Shrine, there's a couple of ways to think about dividing up the map, and one of the most popular ways is inside versus outside. If you happen to be on Alpha Team, which has the outside spawn, you can think about doing the annoying yet effective tactic of using the sunlight at your back to try and blind people who might be attacking you from the inside. Keep in mind though that holding the outside position for a long time may end up hurting you, because eventually the capture point is going to spawn up right here, on the inside of the pillar room. This makes holding the inside a better option the longer the round goes, which is something Bravo Team really enjoys because they spawn right back here. So if you're alpha team, you may want to think about pushing inside and the immediate option would be heading into C cubby, but you can also swing around the long way and try to take A cubby as well. The cubbies offer a nice line of sight, especially at the end of the round when you're fighting for the territory, but remember not to have your entire team bunched up in one cubby together because you're making it really easy for the enemy team to just ruin your whole team with one good grenade. Another good spot on the map is up on either side of the bridge. You have a lot of options when you're up there. Great lines of sight across the majority of the inside of the map and quick access to head in any direction you want, including good flanking opportunities to catch enemies who might be playing defensively by the back bridge areas. The only downside of going up there is that you're also pretty out in the open, so be prepared to either drop down or back up if you start taking heavy fire. As for the heavy ammo, well, that's right here, and both teams have the ability to bait it under the right circumstances. If you're going for heavy, remember to not rush in at it right away. Grenades are going to help you win that fight, along with team shooting and good angles. But that's really most of Trials, isn't it? Again, remember the fundamentals. Don't wander off too far away by yourself. If you find an enemy who has wandered way off by themselves, push that player as a team and kill them. And if you happen to outnumber the enemy team at any point, don't give them the opportunity to get a free revive. Use your number advantage to push in on them together and wipe them out. Alright everyone, if you haven't already, please don't forget to like and share this video if you find it helpful and to subscribe to my channel. As always, I appreciate your support very much. If you have any additional strategies for Burning Shrine on Trials, please feel free to share them below in the comment section. Hope you learned something. See you next time.